Good rising family. I wanted to do a video and share uh, something exciting. Well, exciting for me, but um, I did my open my new deck of cards yesterday. My um, spirit animal oracle cards. And um, I've been wanting to know what spirit animal is connected with me. So I was about to do a reading. Um, like a seven card reading i'm like you know no first i need to know i really need to know what spirit animal is connected with me i know it has to be something like a bird or a spider something like that but definitely so i was like okay let me meditate because i really want to know this so i started shuffling the cards and like poof you know out popped the card and i was like what? I was so excited. So let me show you. Can I do this? Like this way? I hope I don't mess the phone up. Yeah. So look at that. A peacock spirit. And it says, let it shine. That's amazing. So yes, it's a bird. And then look at all the feathers. Like, whoa, I'm like too excited. I'm going to read what it talks about and maybe share that. And I got my feathers up. So let's see. So it says peacock spirit. Let me hold the card up. Let's see what it says. Um, uh, what's that? I should put on my glasses. Oh my glasses. Uh oh, I don't know where to go. So it says, when is the last time you shook a tail feather and shined your light for all to see? Within each of us is a peacock spirit yearning for expression and you are called now to show the world the gorgeous creature you are. Oh, for you are a magnificent manifestation of spirit come out from the shadows peacock spirit says and show your true color so that others may be inspired to express their own exquisiteness i like that it's like helping each other you know you shine everybody shines you know i like it so let me see what else to say it says um I gotta get my glasses. I'll just edit this out because I can't goddamn see. <laughs> right? Damn it. <laughs> anyway. See, I think because my eyes are getting better again. The first time I couldn't see and my contacts weren't working because I've been doing these meditations to fix my eyes. And I went to the eye doctor. I was like, oh, it's not working. My contacts aren't working. He said, oh, your, your eyes got a whole power better. So now they're not working again. I think it may be the same reason. My eyes are getting better. Where did they do that? Right. So anyway. Back to the peacock spirit. Oh, yeah, I can see. So it says, dance as if you remember that you are made of stardust and grace. Filled with life, life force, energy, and sparkling light. You are a channel for divine love, and your dance is one of a kind. I agree with that. Catch the light and help it to shimmer. And dance in celebration of your good fortune of being right here, right now. I like that. It's like staying in the moment. Spirit wants you to be joyful so that others may get up and dance along with you. Hey, hey, yes. That's nice. And I love dancing. But I love being encouraging. And I love being inspiring and helpful. So this is nice. I don't know why I'm blushing about it. So the protection mes message 
Are you afraid of dancing with abandon because of what others might think? No, not at all. Do you think you may be punished if you shine too brightly? No, not at all. But I tell you what, um, there was a thing, uh, you know, coming up. Sometimes you're taught and told um, not to shine so bright, like who you think you are, you know. And when you are told that, that sticks in your head a long time. And that goes against the grain of what you're supposed to be doing here, right? So I do appreciate that question. So now, finally, getting over that, not that I thought I would be punished, but it's like, ooh, but you're not supposed to shrink back. You're supposed to show the world the real you, you know? So anyway, what else does it say? Maybe not everyone will celebrate your beautiful radiance when you shine, and that is okay. Right, like the card I did yesterday. Everyone is not for you. You know, face your own true north. You got to do your own true thing. Um, it says, Peacock Spirit is here to remind you that while others may resist celebrating the beauty within them, although they, they may contract while you expand and shake your tail feathers, smile and keep dancing anyway. Right. Mm-hmm. Because sometimes people, you know, step back from you when you start to do more or they feel intimidated or they say really crazy things, you know, and you think, what, where does that come from, you know? And, um, yeah, you just have to keep going regardless. And, you know, people will catch up. If they don't catch up, well, you know, they're on their own journey. You're on your own journey. And that's what I keep telling myself. You know, it's no difference than on the spiritual path. Versus not on the spiritual path because people are people, what I'm learning. So it says, model the good fortune and abundant joy that is yours. And soon someone will say, me too, and join you. Spirit loves you so much and wants you to enjoy the dance and shine your light. Oh, that's so positive. I love this. And you know, it's so funny that I used to think this stuff was the devil. And I have gotten so much encouragement from my cards and intuition put together. Like, it's crazy how much, you know, beauty and love and guidance and encouragement I've gotten. So what else makes this really cool? Well, first of all, the card number is 46. And you know, that equals 10, which equals one. And I've just finished my 999 transformation. So I have been back getting a lot of 10s back at one. New beginning, new start. And then yesterday my card was like, Expect powerful change. Know it's coming. Show the world the real you. Everyone's not for you. Face the true north. Do your thing. Do your own thing. And it's like, okay. Okay, okay, okay. So the other cool thing is, all right, check this out. When I first moved here, this had to be the second week in November last year. And I was on the beach every day like, ooh, feathers. You know, birds give me feathers. And Finding shells. And look at this pretty shell. Finding shells, you know. I found a lot of these. And look, they kind of match the suit of me. Got that purple aura. You know, because I'm always saying I'm protected in a, a globe of golden white light with golden specks. And I can just see it ever expanding. And it's in a triangle pyramid uh, with a purple aura and all that. So, yeah. I've been finding a lot of things that color. And then this one is real cool, too. Oh, shit. Isn't that pretty? It's like the same color, you know, but I use it for like my little sage and stuff. Isn't that cool? Right? So anyway, so I was finding feathers, you know, the first couple of days and shells and I was so excited. And then out of the blue, I found this. Right? And I was like, what kind of feather is this? I mean, I was finding all different types of birds. Feathers. I don't even know the name of the birds, but I've given them my own names. But anyway, so I found this one. I was like, this is so pretty. It was just like right in front of me, out of the blue. So pretty. You know, it's like black and iridescent, you know, and greens and all the colors. And I kept thinking, is this a peacock feather? No, it can't be. Why would a peacock feather? Because I don't know what the smaller side feathers look like. And I'm like, I don't know what it is, you know. So 
to, to get this card and then to remember I have this feather. And I've had this feather for months. Still couldn't figure it out. So then I did some research on what kind of feather it is. And I was like, whoa, it's from a phoenix chicken. From a phoenix chicken. And when I looked at the chickens, I was like, oh, they are so pretty. And I know. pretty and i know you know chickens are spiritual when you look at those chickens i have to put a picture in this you look at those chickens those are like not the kind of chickens that you just like want to eat or like they have at the store you know beautiful majestic and a whole tail full of feathers like this oh, just like beautiful like i was like i'm getting one of those when i get in my house i'm getting some of those because they are beautiful. So for me to like have bird feathers, but they give me, and then my spirit animal being a peacock, a bird, and then me having this special feather, like it doesn't get any better than that. Like this is so exciting. Like, and a, for, and a card 46, 10, Number one, new beginning, transformation after a 999. Like, I'm so excited. And I keep hearing, show the world the real you, shine. And you know, if we are the ones to help usher in this new age and new era, and we have all the talents, then we have to like do things. We have to, because how else is the world going to reset and restart in the right way without us making it happen? So I'm like, okay. I don't have to keep convincing myself. It's like weirdly exciting, but yeah. So there you go. So I hope y'all don't think this is too goofy, but maybe exciting too. So anyway, peace family. <laughs>